this hill we and if y'all was reading my bio I told y'all I was bringing y'all motion pictures there's only one way to go and that's up WDNT TV film slash all that you dig uh. What's poppin', homie? Talk to him. What's up with the juice? Live from Cleveland, Ohio. It's mm -hmm. cold as fuck out here, and I was a little warm earlier. You already know how it is, though, so Tight. whatever. They're going through a detox today. I ain't smoked no weed. I've been sitting looking at my bag of weed all day. Oh, but the nigga been tired. I've been smoking way too much weed, and I said I wasn't going to smoke shit today. Yeah. But when I come in for work tomorrow, I better believe I'm blazing like three or four of them hoes. Oh, man. <laughs> See, man, I'm going to smoke for you, man. But, <laughs> hey, though, how you feeling, man? Tell them the people what you got new coming out or going on. Well, I uh, just dropped, a, uh, just dropped a, a single Tuesday called Doing the Most. That bitch on all major platforms, YouTube, uh, Apple Music, Spotify. Okay. First, how many, how many days? Nah, it's been out since Tuesday. First five days, I got like 11,000 play. I think it's like 11,000. Uh, yeah. Okay. First couple days, I promote my shit. So how you promoting, homie? Like, I wonder what... It just basically be through through IG, mm. through YouTube. Um, and I already got, like, since I've been out like a year and a half now, I already got fans that's like, always listen to my shit or whatever whenever I drop some new shit. Yeah. And luckily, they put this new, uh, this new shit on Apple Music where they notify you when... Somebody who you following on Apple Music whenever they drop the release. So that what got me a whole lot of plays this time. Um, I'm just going to continue to grind, man. I'm working on some other shit right now that'll probably be out maybe like mid-November sometimes. Maybe like an EP. Uh, oh, EP. Like three, four tracks. I mean, you don't fuck with the EPs. Okay, okay. Now, for people who's watching around the world right now who don't know or don't know what EP is, that's extended play. Now, extended play. Yeah, now, yes, what we cooking up for the mixtape or anything from something else? Man, I'm gonna I'm be honest with you. I, I really can't even hold on to tracks enough, really, to to be putting out EPs and all the rest of that shit. For real, yeah. it's like I go to the studio today, record that shit. That yeah. shit cool as fuck. Yeah. And the way I got my uh my my music uh, distributor set up, I can have that shit out mainstream tomorrow type shit. So it's like, once I record a track, I be wanting to put that shit out. It be for me to hold on to like three, four, ten tracks. Mm -hmm. No, nah, I can't do it. I be so excited to get that shit out. It's like, as soon as I get it, I'm dropping it. As soon as I get it, I'm dropping it. Um, I did release a three track EP back uh, in January. And that shit killed me, man, to, to have to hold on to that shit for so long because <laughs> I wanted to get it out there. But um, I was able to get pre-orders and shit from off of that, which, uh, you know, fat my pockets up a little bit. So you get the pre-orders and you get the pay, uh, the pay per play. So, so how right work? now, you know, so wait, with yeah. the pay per play. Yeah, 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 yeah. Facts. All right. Pay per play. You got a music distributor. Now, if you do not have a music distributor, if you think you're about to get paid off of rap fame and Instagram, <laughs> And all the rest of that is not even happening. Like y'all on or something real quick. School real so quick. it's a whole lot of it's a whole lot of different uh, music distribution sites. Um, my favorite one is is DistroKid because what DistroKid does is they don't charge you. Period. You get all your royalties. So every time you get a play on Apple Music or Spotify or or YouTube or um, a title, these are okay. um, each of them pay a certain percent well not a percent they pay you like 0.5 a half of a penny apple music is the highest right now and you got to get two plays to get a penny basically so 0.76 cent i think apple music pay me for every time somebody play my shit um i didn't tell people before like hey throw my shit on repeat bruh because mm -hmm. uh i'm trying to stack up the coins or whatever able, mm -hmm. if i was able to stream my own music or whatever and make money i had that bitch on repeat all day but unfortunately when you sign up for that shit you have to give them your 
all of your information type shit. So I can sit here and stream this bitch all day a thousand times, and I won't get a penny off of you it. Don't get a penny. Because it's me straight, it's me, it's, it's me streaming. I won't get nothing from oh, off of it. But if you that. was to do that, yeah. you know, I just got it in thousand plays. Talk to and them. it's it's not even that much though. It's only five dollars, bro. That it would basically be about five dollars because everybody pays just about the same. There's nobody paying a penny per play. If it is, I want to know because oh, yeah, I want to start. Yeah, um, yeah, but making money, man, as far as play, that shit is, that shit is dead for real type shit. No, um, um, it actually sounds like a big thing, though. It is, though. So um, If you can get millions of plays, if you can get millions of plays, yeah. You got to get millions, though. Nah, though, M's. M's I done been play. putting shit out for like a year and a half, man, and I'm, I'm close to 100,000. It's like, 73,000, something like that. 73,000, um, man. And, and that's, you know, that's, it's cool, you know, but if you're trying to make, good thing I ain't trying to make money off of it, because if I were trying to make money off of it, then I'd be, I'd be, no, I, I wouldn't be, I'd be out here starving, bro, so. I get that. So who could we expect for you to be working with next, man? I know that you're working with somebody. I know you're cooking up over this. My name is Corey Marshawn. Okay. Uh, he got a, uh, he got an LP. Now this nigga, he can hold, he can hold on to tracks. Me and this nigga recorded this track like a couple months ago. He didn't edit it and shit. Mm. But I'm gonna be a feature on his track. Uh, it should come out the end of November. Okay. And then I'm working on a remix to my song called uh, Switch Up, which my nigga Flex is gonna be on that shit. So okay. we currently working on that, and that's gonna probably be on my EP that uh that's dropping at the end of next month or the middle of next month. Probably like a month. So. Around Thanksgiving time. Um, other than that, I mean, I got niggas hit me up every day trying to work, so it just... I can only take music to a point. I ain't even gonna sit here and cap to because yeah. this is not my number one money maker. Um, Talk to him. I, I love music, though. I love music. That's a fact. So, for so, all the people who want to come and um, check you out right now, man, how would they find you on what platforms? All right. On IG and YouTube, you can hit me up at uh, J Got Juice two one six, and anywhere else. Hey, I'm doing this interviewer. Uh, hold on, hold on. Shut up, Sheba. Um, uh, hit me up at J Got Juice two one six on YouTube and Instagram. And if you want to look up my music on Apple Music, Spotify, wherever else, I'm just J Got Juice. That's it. Okay. Unless they shadow ban me again, you shouldn't have to press that. Oh, if oh, you just man. type in J God, yeah, Apple was on that shadow ban and mm. shit. And I can cuss their ass out in the email, tell them to stop doing that. Apple, come but, on. But um, just J God juice. Apple. All right. Um, and normally, man, I take <laughs> this right here part of the segment, man. I let my people go plug in and do all these shout outs, man. So if there's anybody that you want to shout out, man, in any city, any state, and you on right now, go. Well, I would like to shout out my engineer also who I'm doing a who I'm doing a video with Corey Marshawn. It's been a year and a half. He he the one who actually got me in into rapping and into music kind of because I would go over to his house and they would have studio sessions and I'd be like, damn, I know I can rap better than these people. <laughs> so <laughs> like for real, I did. That's no lie. And then people started asking me to do features and all the rest of that. And I, I did a couple features and I mean it was cool. And then I started putting down my own shit. Right. Um, and like I said, I got. About 75,000 plays in a year and a half. So I, my, my first track I put out last year was April 26th of 2021. So now it's, yeah, it's basically a, a year and a half, 18 months. Okay. So 18 months, I got about 75,000 plays uh, yes. worldwide. Yes. A lot of stuff overseas. Most of the stuff in the U.S., of course, Canada, yes. Mexico, Brazil, Portugal, Spain, uh, Japan. Uh, Australia, Sweden, <laughs> Iceland, to to get to that Norway. <laughs> I mean, I, I got plays in just about every country around, at least 40 different countries. <laughs> so, That's a fact. so far, I appreciate everybody's support. Yeah. And uh, just continue to stick with me, and I'm going to continue to put out some hot shit. That's a fact. No doubt. Well, um, there we have it, man. Uh, um, Sit back in with the homie Jay Got Juice, man. He's out here. Y'all go check him out. And y'all stream this video to me on TT on YouTube. And that's y'all was reading my bio. I told y'all I was bringing y'all motion pictures. There's only one way to go, and that's up. I'm bringing.